There are new developments in a nearly 20 year old homicide investigation. Today, the San Diego County Sheriff's Department announced it has ID human remains that were found in a Rancho San Diego dumpster back in 2003. An arrest has also been made. As our ABC 10 News reporter Rena Nakano explains, the sheriff is crediting modern technology for helping to solve this case. For the first time in 18 years, a local family finally has answers. It's a bittersweet, but it's happiness almost across the board. In October 2003, the San Diego Sheriff's Department responded to a 911 call after someone found a pair of legs stuffed in a Rancho San Diego apartment complex dumpster. The legs were that of an adult female. For years, she remained a Jane Doe until the cold case team took over last summer using investigative genetic genealogy, the same techniques used to bring in the Golden State Killer. DNA was sent to the lab. Then we uploaded it to a public genealogy database. I then got a familial match. Detective Troy Dugall and his team first found a distant relative in the 1800s. Then they collected samples from 20 relatives and worked their way down the family tree to finally name the Jane Doe. Through further DNA testing, the woman was identified as Lori Diane Potter. Then, through traditional detective work, they found substantial evidence that pointed to 54-year-old Lori Potter's suspected killer, her husband. On Wednesday, the San Diego Fugitive Task Force arrested Jack Dennis Potter, now 68 years old, at his home in Rancho Cucamonga for murder. It's the first time a law enforcement agency in San Diego region has used this to identify a victim and arrest a suspect. The victim's family, and I've spoke to them, are very happy that I, number one, identified Lori because they thought she was just living and somewhere nobody knew. Um, and they're extremely happy once they get over the grief of Lori being deceased that we've identified and arrested the suspect. Rena Nakano, ABC 10 News. Deputies say the murder investigation is still ongoing. Jack Potter will appear in a San Diego County court to face murder charges coming up next Thursday.